Hello everyone, welcome back to LSPDFR. We just wrapped up a patrol up here in Palito Base. We're going to jump in and do some highway patrol. And one of the agencies we have for highway patrol, we're going to be using, this is the SHP. But it has the Florida Base Liberty. And we're starting up here in Palito Bay. Somebody's trying to break into the ambulance. Get on the ground! A hooker trying to break into our ambulance. I've been waiting all day to use this. Their teeth? Fucking hey, you wanna shit in a bag the rest of your life? There's somebody in the back of the ambulance? Huh? Okay. Well, this is the way it started everything, huh? First thing, we get a, uh, someone trying to break into the ambulance here, up here at Plato Bay PD. We'll go ahead, go ahead and let our partner search for everything. But we're going to be doing one of our SHP agencies today. We have multiple SHP agencies here on the map. I'm going to, be, I'm going to redo it though. I'm going to have it structured a little bit different. But um, So she's going to go to jail for uh, still in the vehicle. We'll put her in the vehicle and um, we're right here at it, so we'll just go ahead and let we'll take care of it. Um, this car pack, guys, I'll let you know about this car pack in just a minute. We kind of got thrown into this before I was ready, but so. Okay, this car pack is uh, Ranger Z's one of his LSPD car packs. It is an older car pack. It was uh, it was uh, had a Liberty based off of Washington Metro PD, uh, but we uh, were using it for our highway patrol. Let me show you the lights here. So that's your stage one for this car pack. Really good looking light bar in the back. Some lights in the back window. Your stage two. Your stage three for this uh, tourist. Here's the interior. The PC is a little bright, but like I said, this is an older car pack, and some of the older car packs did do that. That was just something that at that time they didn't know how to fix. Now that now they know how to actually fix that, where it doesn't do it. So, but that's okay. You know, it has a shotgun rack, it has the speaker, has the the partition, everything. It is it is still a good looking car pack, so it is still good to use. So we're gonna get out here on the highway. We're gonna, we're gonna get out of Palito Bay and see what we can get into on the highway. Maybe we'll run a little bit of radar, you know, stuff like that, just to. Our red light is missing here for some reason. Okay, I don't know why that's missing, but...
Look at that little rabbit. So we're gonna get out of Plato Bay, let Plato Bay do their job and uh, handle the city. We're gonna go out, get out here on the highway. Unless something comes up, and we have to come back up here. That's the fastest red light I've ever seen. Two seconds is back to green. And this is a 2016 Taurus. Or as they call it, a FBIS. Go ahead and turn radar on too. I forgot to turn that on. Hear that radar cl that radar clicking up. Attention all units. A 503, a stolen police vehicle in uh, Palato Bay. We're going to respond to that. That is a stolen police vehicle. I know it's in the city, but it is a stolen police vehicle. Which is very per important. Units reporting a suspect resisting arrest in Palato Bay. Unit to respond, code 3. Get a chopper. Dispatch, perfect sight. 505, this animal's on the freeway. Eagle 6 is in support. We have suspect eastbound. Dispatch, we have the suspect in sight. Ooh, look out. As are the DPS department. Alright, we're going to see if we can pin them. We're clear to pit. We ain't got the top end that to that charger's got. Get out of the tunnel here, we're gonna try it again. No about Blaine County. Backup required on Sonora Freeway and Braddock Pass. Unit to spawn code 3. Green 2, we're in the area. His, his vehicle's hard to pit. Oh, we got him. Get out of the car! Out of the car! 
down. Give it up. You're not going Hands anywhere. Hands up, cream pie, right now. Hey, Who dispatch, the suspect is on foot. You're making things worse. You're mine now. You're in arrest. Is there other state trooper agency? LSPD, stand down. You are going down. Attention, all units. We are code four. All right, so we're gonna let these vehicles get out of the way, and we're gonna close off the road. Stop traffic. So we can kind of work here. She has suspended lives and gonna have our partner search her. Go ahead and get this Felina Bay PD vehicle out of here. Assistance required on a uh Sonora Freeway. She could be charged with possession of a stolen vehicle. Flatbed. A police vehicle. On, uh, Fly across the hood. She's going to be charged with possession of a um, stolen emergency vehicle. Okay. Blaine County is going to take her in. All right, book her for uh, possession of a stolen uh, sheriff vehicle, uh, police vehicle. And we'll wait for the Blaine County to uh, get his prisoner in the car and we'll open the road back up. Fifteen and Pereira del Sol units respond code two. Ten four. All right, we'll get back out here and see what we can get it to. Kind of stick on the highway we can. Sometimes what I do though is, is highway patrol. Um, I kind of go down and go through Harmony and come back up through Sandy Shores when I'm up in this area and uh, come back in, on the interstate. already been a wild patrol. We got an ambulance to get stolen the first thing. Uh, yeah, it was a theft of a little bay PD vehicle. All units, we've got an 11351 in Santiago Mountain Range. I'll let Park Rangers handle that. I mean, we get any vehicles um, when we're driving, you know, they're speeding or any flags, we'll uh, pull them over. Got a truck to... Like that one. Expired license.
target vehicle license plate. 42 Henry John Paul 159ers. A traffic violation. Approach with caution. Good evening, sir. Trooper Burnett with the San Andreas Highway Patrol. Stopped you because our ARPR system come back saying you had an expired license. But Driver is sweaty and nervous. Alright, sir, sit tight. We'll be right back with you. He does have a expired license and he's on parole. He's got two arrests, two citations, so he's going to get another one for driving with expired CDLs. He has a CDL license. Uh, let's see, I don't know if it has one for that under our CDL rules here. Let's see. Expired registration, expired entry. Yep, here it is. Inspired tag, inspired license tag. Well, it doesn't say. We're gonna get him for this one. Um, operating a CVV is what inspired CDL. Get him for that. What we're gonna do. Alright, sir, you can be receiving one citation today. Uh, that's for you want to go ahead and sign on the dotted line down there. The court date's on the back. Alright, have a good afternoon. We'll sit right here just for a minute so we can catch a speeder. I don't have my radar um, gun active right now. I gotta put that mod back in for that. We'll get somebody here in just a minute. It don't take long. Officers report all units respond. Code 99 emergency. I didn't see where that had been that way. Alright, we're gonna mosey on down the road here in just a minute. Yeah, we got one. Got to catch up to it. Oh, 
Are they gonna run? No. So this car fact guys that we're using for the San Andreas Highway Patrol, uh, this agency comes with a Taurus, a 2014 Charger, a, 20, a 2018 Charger, and a 2016 Explorer. Alright, so we're going to stop this vehicle for speeding. Target vehicle license plate, 20 Lincoln Frank King 014. Target is 10-4. Good evening, ma'am. Trooper Burnett with the Sun Address Highway Patrol. We stopped you because you were speeding today. Running about 10 miles over the limit. Let's see some ID, huh? The... It has a, sm a small odor of narcotics from inside the vehicle okay all right sit tight for me ma'am right, she has a clean record I mean she has two tickets um, public indecency with drugs and then a parking in the bus zone. I don't know if there's any buses in here, but except for public transit, but okay. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna write her a citation for speed, and then we're gonna see if she has any issues that been drinking or anything. We're getting a, a hit of alcohol from the vehicle, so that gives us uh, the right to um, ask for a breathalyzer. Alright, ma'am. You'll be getting one citation a day for speeding. Alright, I'm gonna also gonna need you to uh, step out of the vehicle. Okay, she, are you refusing to step out of our vehicle? Out of your vehicle? Alright, she is refusing. So we're gonna we're gonna get another unit out here. We'll get a local unit out here. Assistance required in. We'll wait on a local to get here. Adam Four, copy. All right, ma'am, get out of the vehicle. Get on the ground. This would have been went a lot simpler. You just would have stepped out of the vehicle. And follow me back over here. From the front of our cruiser. Now, we're going to do a test on you. Now, I may let this go. If you're not getting out of the vehicle, that is something that I may, uh, you know, just let it go. Do a breathalyzer on you. Thank you. Alright, she's clean on the breathalyzer. Thank you. You do have drugs on you. Uh, she had Mary Jane and... Okay. So at this time, ma'am, you will be placed under arrest today for drugs on you.
All right, and the, and the vehicle had a bottle of wine, a Legend Sports Motorsports brochure, a phone number from a scratch writer on a scrap piece of paper, several scopes and silencers in a wallet, passenger side, nothing of interest, driver's side, I mean, driver's side was all that, passenger side, nothing of interest, and trunk was nothing of interest. Flatbed it. Flatbed. Assistance required in Santiansky Mountain Range. So we're going to get a flatbed out here to pick that vehicle up. And she's going to be charged. I'm not going to charge her for not getting out of the vehicle. I could uh, technically charge her for resisting, but I'm not going to do that. She'll be charged for her drugs. And we're gonna have her take, have Blaine County take her in. Assistance required in Santiansky Mountain Range. If he don't get hit by a truck. All right, we're gonna get back out here and uh, we're gonna circle down to a uh, grape seed and do a little bit of, uh, just ride through there. It's not normal our jurisdiction, you know. But. Citizens report a robbery on a okay. uh, Sonora freeway. Actually, we're not. Got a report of a robbery here on the freeway. Pretty much we're right where we left from. They're running. Good chopper. The stop, dude. And if I catch you, I'm gonna tase you. Backup required in Santiansky Mountain Range. Units respond code three. Gonna get hit by a train. Dispatch suspect located. Moving to engage. He got my health a little bit. He's down. Get EMS out here. Ambulance. Assistance required in Santiansky Mountain Range. Yeah. 
Tell me about it. Thank Come you. on, people. All right. He has uh, some whiskey, a phone number from a written on a vanilla envelope, vanilla unicorn envelope. Let's do it. Napkin. Oh, man, this is awful. Okay. I can't speak today, guys. Sorry about that. She so got one on the run. All right, they're gonna take him in. We're going back to my vehicle. Dispatch, Ocean One responding. I could teleport, but I'm not gonna do that. I said the chopper. There she is. Dispatch, we have the suspect in sight. Get on the ground. Drop the weapon. LSPD, hands up. Slow down. Drop it. <laughs> it's one of those call outs that's messed up where he won't. Drop the weapon. Let me see those hands. Yeah, it's messed up. It's not gonna let you let her give up. The call out's messed up. Which normally means that it hasn't been updated like it needs to be for the latest version of LSPDFR. When it does that, let's get another ambulance out here. Ambulance assistance required in Santiago Sea Mountain Range. Now, let me go get my vehicle. Turn off the siren. Walk over here, sir. So you're out of the room. Stay right there. Backup needed in Santiago State Mountain Range. Green 2, we are on our way. Freeway. Somebody did not let me run plates. I don't know what's going on with that. I've never seen that before where it won't let you run a plate. Mm -mm. It's not letting me run plates on these vehicles. We'll just go ahead and get this cleared up. Flatbed. Assistance required on Sonora Freeway. That's one of our other agencies back there. It's uh, another highway patrol agency. Let's 
some ID, huh? Thank you. I'm gonna call him a taxi. He's clean. Thank you. Thank you. Go ahead and get this vehicle out of the road. We're going to go down here with our partner. I have to call a corner out here, looks like. Empty condom wrapper and a hunting license. Okay. Assistance required in Santiago Mountain Range. We're gonna slow down traffic. No. So the corn don't get run over. We'll kind of wait on a corner to get cleaned up and then we'll uh, open traffic back up normal. Guys, I have not got the Blaine County red lights to work. I wish they would work, but they will not work this time. So I'm going to have to wait until uh, I have to reinstall and see if I can get it to work then. But as of right now, they don't work. So, And we're our, our patrol is just about up here. We're going to find where we can park up here. Right here would be a good spot. We'll turn around right here. Well, Alright guys, that's going to be it for this video. Um, getting in here doing some San Andreas Highway Patrol. We have some other agencies to go through for, for the Highway Patrol, so we're not done with that. And um, I want to say thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. If you want to be subscribing, and don't forget if you are new and you like the videos, to hit the subscribe button and the bell. I know we don't ask, but YouTube has really been on, everyone, on us about doing it. So, thank you. If, everyone that has been doing it and I uh, have a good day